this that plug talk, not no plug wall. You could Google me, that's plug talk. Like one on one, this out of plug wall. Kanye shrug wall. Yo, 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 and welcome back to another episode of Plug Talk Reviews, brought to you by none other than Plug Talk 101. I just want to give a special thanks and a special shout out to my Patreon members on that channel. Because of y'all, you guys are making everything possible where I could do other things like this. Hardware reviews, okay? And da 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 wrong sound effect but you see what we ordered it is none other than the mighty plus now i'm sure you knew that because of the title but uh let's get to this video <laughs> now as you can see while we open this bitch up it's a smaller box in a very big box that is minus points I, I you know i don't understand why they would do that that would just just you know other, other than that, let's just go ahead. We remove all of the packing material. We had an extra box. Let's put that to the side. I don't want to ruin anything. I always have trouble removing this pesky, pesky film there that are always over these boxes. But, you know, I am utterly surprised. Now, as I struggle to get this bitch open, because I'm trying to figure it out here while I'm looking at the camera. Ah, there it is. A nice safety sticker. That's how you know your product hasn't been fucked with. Now we open this bitch up. The first thing I see is the first thing I like. Not the warranty sticker, but when boxes are filled to the brim, it just makes uh, less waste in terms of cardboard. Now, the first thing we get is a nice little pamphlet. Let's flip it right side up. I'll flip everything right side up for y'all. Don't worry about it. But you can see it's a nice little pamphlet. It shows their lineup, what they have, the introduction to convection, conduction, hybrid technology. And this is why I did actually get this vape because it works very different than my Zeus Arc GTS even though I got it because they both have some similarities in regards to being a third generation vape. Here's another little, you know, instruction manual, just real quick breakdowns. We're, we're gonna go through this all later in the operation and uh, the review of the three vapes I have, but this is an unboxing for those that want to know. And I must say, I was very surprised. It looks like everything that's coming out of that part of the world is a uh, better quality than other parts and um, I'll leave it at that but um as we take out this vape the first thing I realized holy fuck this bitch is light and that is because it is made out of medical grade plastic now what does that mean all the other vapes that you guys might have might be metal might be a little heavy yes this vape in particular that I'm holding is bigger in size it is lighter in weight take that for what it is how that impacts you but that's the first thing i noticed i do realize these grooves that it has that you can see these little grooves that are curved they actually stop your thumb from touching directly on the chamber or on the battery so it doesn't get hot the other vapes i've had substantially was hotter in your hands this vape doesn't get hot w already w already say it one more time with me guys double you already now let's continue with this unboxing and um enjoy the video guys make sure to hit that subscribe make sure to follow the instagram and we're gonna go ahead and kick down these doors you heard what's the first thing that we get out of the box other than the vape it is another w guys it is none other than a fucking usb-c cable what does this mean let me give you a secret guys if you put this cable on a mac book laptop charger you get fast charging what does that mean 80 percent in 40 minutes holy fuck this alone is a w that brush that you see me take out w that pod that you see me take out w these replace well these replacement you know bits it's not really a W, it's kind of standard with any vape you get, but it is nice to have, right? But the USB-C is a W. The fact that you could leave your vape on the charger and turn it on is a W. Granted, the charger will stop charging, but you get the gist, right? So we already threw away that uh, instruction manual. No, we didn't, we just put it to the side. You guys see all the replacement parts. You guys see, I'm showing you guys the aluminum 
pods compared to the other pods of the Zeus Arc GTS with the paper tops. This has an aluminum top, which means it doesn't really alter your taste. I'll just give you guys a quick spoiler. The Zeus Arc GTS, I stopped using the pods and I started just filling the chamber. The Mighty Plus, I don't fill the chamber, I use the pods. Take it for what it is. Uh, that's kind of spoiler alert, but you know what it is. All right, and we got this little box here. We got eight more pods and it comes with its own little disc. You feel me? Like, I like that. It's like a slimmer version of a two-step grinder. It's so, it's ergonomic. I'm gonna just leave it at that. I was pleasantly surprised upon using these pods the taste is not altered one bit and being that is aluminum and not paper tops you don't always got to go back to purchase more tops you know you can see this vape is a screw on the other vapes i had they were all magnetic this one is a screw on how do i feel about that i don't know yet because it is a little annoying in regards to uh keep that keep doing that action but you know you get used to it it's just a super minor inconvenience you see we got the nice ceramic bowl i did notice and it bugged me out how shallow the bowl is i was thinking there's no way i'm getting a diamond there but to my surprise you can because it's very wide you see we got this pick mind you the only way this vape stands up like you can see here is if the pick is in backwards a lot of people are crying about it but you see i have three vapes here and the zeus arc gts came with its own pick so that orange pick in the back of the mighty stays like that so my mighty is always standing and i have another pick to do with whatever i need to deal with we're turning on the vape for the first time it wasn't on 100 percent battery it was only on one battery bar it is what it is but we're not really going to deal with it because this is only an unboxing now if you guys want to see more videos like this or the comparison video make sure you guys stay tuned hit that subscribe just help the algorithms out and drop a like drop a comment it's that plug talk